My name is Derek Tiny Salachai, and this is my father's 1989 Carrera Silver Edition. Hopefully, nobody won't mine one day. Assuming he doesn't sell it off. Yeah, uh, I don't have my own 911 because I'm a broke college student right now. I should probably tell my dad thanks and also hope that he doesn't see this film. When you're looking at classic cars and stuff, the great thing about looking at old Porsches is that you just know they're gonna work. There's a reason there's so many of them out there right now. I mean, any event you go to with classic cars, 90% of them will be Porsche just because they last. Me and my father were looking at a 911 Turbo slant nose Targa. Uh, we showed pictures of the car to my mom and she just absolutely hated how it looks. She didn't like the Targa top. And so she was just against it from day one. So we found a 89 Mondi LT Coupe Ferrari. Mom loved the look, it was bright red. So of course she said to get that instead. My father and I flew out to Georgia to pick it up actually. And uh, being classic Italian, it broke down halfway. So I flew back, my dad stayed with the car, and ever since then it parked more than it ran. We never let my mom live that down, so now whenever we find something cool, she just doesn't even want to hear it. She just lets us do what we do, and um, that's how we end up with this. The Targa Baja is a uh, classic rally through Mexico, which you have to bring a classic car. So just thought we'd take the most reliable car we could, and that was the Porsche. You know, a lot of millennials nowadays don't really care about cars, at least the way people used to care. We planned for a Targa Baja months in advance. I was trying to get a couple of my friends to go just to help me navigate and just help take care of things. It didn't really seem that interesting to them. It was just me and a bunch of old dudes driving around Mexico. So they didn't really put enough effort into making everything line up to go. Topped out at 140, wouldn't go any faster. But do I need to? But uh, after I sent them all the pictures and the videos and just what we were doing out there, they, they all regret not going. And I had a couple more friends trying to hop in with me next year now. People that go to these Targa events are kind of next level. They're obviously very successful to be able to do the things they do to go to these events and have the cars they have. And, just being able to go at the age I am and tag along and just meet these people is just an amazing experience. Because, you know, I hope to be able to afford one of these one day. And, you know, these are just the kind of guys that can help me do it and they know how to do it. So, yep, give me a ride because my car took a <laughs> shit. <laughs> Ha 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 ha!